back again. You're probably thinking, where the heck did the band box go? Well, heck, where did we go? We've still been here the whole time. We've just been crazy busy. I said we'd get these videos up sometime before next year. Of course, I was yeah. <laughs> never really said what year it was in. Well, I did. So it is still 2019. And we are finishing the run, but the stack has grown, as it tends to do. We just... I'm a college student now. And she works full time, so <laughs> I just patiently wait as the boxes... You don't even want to see the ones out there. We are going to do a marathon like we usually do. Eventually we'll be on point. We love the band box. You guys are awesome. We've got February, so it's going to be a lot of pop culture. For... We're going way back. <laughs> oh, yes. February. It must be cold for some of you up there. <laughs> we don't tell you what month it is. Nah, it's not that late. But so we're gonna do February, March, and April. And then that catches us up with the horror that we had done. And then we have May and June. And then we are caught up, finally. <laughs> and then we have a bunch of other stuff to film. But we will get back to that at some other point in time. I can keep talking, but the boxes aren't gonna open themselves. And I'm gonna get stabbed here any moment. So what I'm going to have to say is, it is some crazy month of 2019. It's the band box. Another famous mega marathon of craziness and pop culture and horror and what the heck. We just love BAM. So, let's get into it. It's been a, a while. <laughs> it has. It's been a while. Then I got a bunch of collectible videos that I filmed. I'm going to be under a rock for a month editing <laughs> craziness. But so, a bunch of videos coming. Your way. I have a kawaii crate. It's a mm -hmm. crate from Japan. Oh, yeah, yeah. I have two of those to unbox now. And me and Alberto, we're going on a cruise in two weeks. Uh, it would probably be a week by the time this is over. I'll still be editing here, so it's okay, <laughs> yeah. you know. But we got a ton of, like, anime merchandise for this cruise. Somehow it became, like, an anime cruise for us. But anyway, so we'll, we'll kind of do a little haul of all that before we leave. <laughs> but we'll eventually get caught up because the, the schedules are going to start to... <laughs> yeah. I know that there's... There's Funko Pops in them, their boxes, somewhere. Yay! Oh, oh perfect! Ah, oh, perfect for me! Oh, sunglasses, sorry. No, you're good, you're good, you're good, because the sunglasses are are usually, oh, and they're pink. They're yes, definitely for, for you, yes. She feels like she's much taller than me when she sits. Is that vacation ready? <laughs> and these are like real UV eye protecting sunglasses. So they're not just like the prop ones. So they are pink glasses. And it, it almost looked like Stitch, but oh, my eyes are getting bad. Oh, yeah, is that? Cool. Optimus. That looks like like an Optimus Prime. Yeah. Transformers. That's cute. I like it. My eyes are getting wore out. Retro iconic. Got the little bandana. I like Transformers. Yes, we do. There's some kind of a cardboard foldy thing, but we'll do the print. Oh, that's cool. Do you remember these? Yeah, the cabbage, not cabbage patch. Well, um, so yeah, 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 cabbage patch kids, but they were the garbage pail kids. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Which were the? I know. I used to collect these. The evil twins or the? Yeah. The ones that didn't make the cabbage patch run. Yeah. The ones that didn't get adopted. They threw <laughs> them out. Threw them in the garbage. That's really not how the story went. But anyway. Oh, um. um Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. See now, this is good because there's such a, this goes so far back that there's no likeness whatsoever. <laughs> so, there's been rumors my whole life that I resemble this person that's here. I've never really actually seen it myself. Like, I've been like, yeah, but then I saw something with an interview from him the other day at just a right <laughs> angle and I went, oh crap. But, uh, so yes, but now this is from Stand By Me, actually. This is one of his very oh, yeah, early is, roles. Yeah. So this is pre-Lost Boys. Yeah. Because when Lost Boys came out, that's when I really started to hear it. I well, had my hair kind of well, up there. Well, I include a little snippet here of the time that I did, like, the face changer with his face over my dad's. And it she was, did like, no change whatsoever. It so. was, it, there was a change. <laughs> But yes, so people say that, I don't know, I, and I, I was going to go to a convention and meet him and things just didn't work out right. I was going to tell him that I wanted royalties because he's yeah. been running around using my face, making money off of it while I sit at home working hard. Oh, this is cool. 11, so of course, yeah. Ego. Yeah. All, that, all that's back, that's like season one, right? Mm -hmm. With the, where she's got the blonde wig. Or is that season one? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this is cute. So he has like a Stranger Things. It's got Best Stored Upside Down, Eleven Homestyle Waffles. 
Oh wow, look at that in the back. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Bean box puts out such great stuff. So it yeah, drives me nuts like when the this. boxes just sit there because I'm like, man, there's goodness in them there boxes. I just gotta kind of stand there and look at them. Boy, here we go now. Oh, you know what? This this worked out well. Because with the with the pins, mm -hmm. I mean, there's Alf. Yeah. You remember, well, Alf. I, kind I mean, of. I yeah, had a puzzle. And, and repeats. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they're they're talking. Actually, I think they're they're going to actually reboot that TV series. Hmm. I think he eats cats. So I like him already because oh, I'm not I a big so. cat guy. And then Garbage Pail Kids. Oh, was the whole cast of Stand by Me? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So this is one where he's got the switch blades. Oh, I'm going to kill you. What's the what's uh, the sunglasses? Well, we it's signed by Bradley Gregg, Eyeball Chambers, and then they had a, a print limited to 500 for Shredder. But yeah, I like the Garbage Pail Kids. What was the glasses? Just like throwback 80s. Oh, just throwback 80s. Mm -hmm. Well, very good. Well, we're starting off with uh, a good. This is a good opening for us. We got some some. Yeah, of course, I'll I'll begrudgingly say that I like the print. <laughs> we'll have to put this to the. I was gonna settle it with him and just. just I know. Rah, and that would have yeah. been the end of it. It would have been like meeting your. What do they call that? Your your, your doppelganger. Doppelganger. <laughs> I'm sure you will one day. But you know, I think, and I think we're. I think he's a little older than I am. Yeah, he is. A few years. A lot of years. I'm. I'm. I'm only twenty. <laughs> yeah, that would work out well. But yes, so fantastic. Full steam ahead. March coming up, and that looks like there could be. I think that was the first month that they had a signed Funko Pop. You know we don't like Funko Pops around here. Yeah. <laughs> so on that note, we want to thank everybody for taking the time to watch. Please like, subscribe, comment below, and share with your friends. Until next time, stay weird. Bye.